This is BBC World News. I'm Geetha Gurumuthi with the headlines. Officials in Egypt say at least 40 people have been killed after security forces opened fire during a protest by supporters of the deposed President Mohamed Morsi. The Islamist Salafist al Nur party has withdrawn from talks to form a new government following the deaths. Investigators say the South Korean plane that crashed at San Francisco airport was travelling too slowly to land safely. The airline says the pilot was a veteran flyer but had less than 50 hours flying experience in Boeing 777. Canada's Prime Minister has described the centre of a town hit by a runaway train as looking like a war zone. At least five people were killed and as many as 40 others are missing. And a former Chinese railways minister has been given a suspended death sentence after a high-profile corruption trial. Liu Zhejun, who oversaw China's bullet train development, was convicted of taking bribes and abuse of power. Those are the headlines on BBC World News.